Hello, it's Mad Science Channel, and today we will see one of the most shocking releases. We will show you the meeting of Mandis and a Lich. How will it end? We will find out soon. Let's go! The video is an informative one and does not call for violence. The video demonstrates the features of keeping and feeding Mandis at home. If such scenes are unpleasant for you to watch, we ask you to stop watching this video. Just recently we already talked about medical leeches. If you are interested, be sure to watch the first part about these unusual creatures, which are of the type ringworms or annelida. When we got these leeches, we were presented with the appropriate certificate of quality. It is best to store them in a jar in a refrigerator. Under these conditions, the activity of medical leeches is significantly reduced. In fact, they become hibernated. The weight of a medical leech is on average about 2 grams. At one time, it is able to suck up to 15 milliliters of blood. Blade is resting. If measures in drops, then this is 300 drops of blood. Now we pass to one more hero of our release. This is a Mandis. Males usually live up to 3 months while females can live two, three times longer. In the home and with the proper care, mantises can live on average up to one year. This mantis lives with us for about three and a half months. And he feels great. He became quite selective about food. Look, the larva of the Zephobus crawls just next to the praying mantis. On average, mantis need to be fed with Zephobus once every 12 days. Can a mantis and a medical leech meet in nature? Of course, but we are wondering what will happen if their meeting takes place in the insectarium. Attention! If you do not like the sight of blood, we ask you to immediately stop watching this video. As soon as the leech appeared inside, Mandis almost immediately drew attention to it. When it approached him, he attacked. Praying Mandis has never seen leeches before, but definitely decided to taste it. The leech tried to escape, but occasionally turned out to be nearby every time, and as a result, the Mandis repeated its attacks. Could the victim try to somehow resist the aggressor and attack by sucking on a mantis? Yes, but only theoretically. Please note that the mantis was able to bite through the skin of his prey. This surprised us very much, because at leeches it is thick and strong. Before the start of the experiment, we could not even think that there would be so much blood in the video. Perhaps the reason for this is the blood stick that we fed the leeches in the last issue. From the outside, the scene of Prey and Mandy's eating leech looked pretty creepy. At the same time, even when it was actually eaten alive, the victim still tried to escape. We decided to continue filming in order to finally answer the question of what will happen if we feed the mantis with a medical leech. Are they suitable as regular food? Definitely no, even if they can diversify the diet. It is much better to use Turkmen cockroach or ordinary crickets for this purpose.
That's all for today. One more Leech Editions. Write the word WANT in the comments. Subscribe to the channel, share the video with your friends and press the bell so as not to miss new issues about wildlife. It was Mad Science Channel. Thanks for watching and see you soon.